Hello friends, welcome to Nand Kishore classes. Today's lecture is going to be very interesting. Today we are going to understand why multiplication of any number with 0 gives a result 0. For example, 2 multiply 0 is equal to 0. Many students really gets confused because they don't know its answer that why they are taking it as 0. So we are going to clarify this concept today. Before we clarify directly with 2 times 0 as 0, let me come up with a general example. For example, if I say 2 times 3, what is the meaning of 2 times 3? 2 times 3 according to definition means addition of 3 twice. This is what the meaning of 2 times 3 is. 3 plus 3 is 6. That is why 2 times 3 makes 6. Right? If you know the basic concept, this is the word. Even the name says like 3 times 2. Same example. 3 times 2. That means you are going to write this 2 thrice. 2 plus 2 plus 2 makes it 6. So this is what the meaning is. If this is 2, that means 3 is being added twice. If this is 3, that means 2 is being added thrice. We can take more examples as well. Let me show you. For example, if we have 4 times 3. See, 4 times 3 means 3 is being added 4 times. That means 3 plus 3 plus 3 plus 3. This is equal to 12. That is why 4 times 3 is 12. Now coming to our question. Let's suppose my question was 2 times 0. 2 times 0. What does that mean? 2 times 0 means 0 is being added twice. 0 means nothing. When nothing is added twice, you will get nothing, right? So that is why 0 plus 0 is 0. This is the reason 2 times 0 is 0. I hope you are clear with the concept. Same way if it is 3 times 0, that means 0 plus 0 plus 0. Since this is 0, so 3 times 0 is also 0. So there should not be any confusion now. Now I know that one question must be arising in your mind. That why are we explaining 2 times 0? What will happen if it is 0 times 2? I would rather say yes, answer is 0 again. 0 times 2 is 0 because multiplication is commutative. You can interchange them. For example, 2 times 3 and 3 times 2, both are same. I know that multiplication is commutative. When this gives me same result, 4 times 6 and 6 times 4, it gives me same result. Same is the way 2 times 0 and 0 times 2 will give me the same result. But I know that still many of you might not be satisfied with the answer. Again, you think very carefully. Let's suppose 0 times 2. See, whatever the value here is, that many number of times we add the next value, right? For example, if it is 2 times 3, that means you are adding 3 twice. Because of this 2, you are adding twice. Now, because of this 0, 0 means nothing. That means you need not to add 2 now. When we are not adding anything, when we are not adding anything, that means it is 0 because we don't have anything right now with us. You can think in that way also. Because this 2 means you will add twice. If it is 1 multiply 3, that means 3 is being added once. So at least one time you are writing 3. If one time you are writing 3, still you are getting answer as 3. But when I say it is 0 multiply 3, that means you need not to write 3, dear. If you are not writing anything, then how can you get any further result? So no result will be there. It will be null only. So there are different type of explanations which I have tried to explain you and I hope you are clear with the concept also.
थैंक यू सो मच फॉर वॉचिंग द वीडियो